Have thine own way, Lord, have thine own way. Thou art the potter and we are the clay. Mold us and make us after your will. While we are waiting, yield it and still bless us today in Jesus' name. Amen. Ephesians chapter 6, beginning in verse 10 through verse 20. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all, to stand. Stand, therefore, having your loins girt about with truth, and having on the breastplate of righteousness, and your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace, above all, taking the shield of faith, wherewith ye shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked, and take the helmet of salvation, and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Spirit, and watching thereunto with all perseverance and supplication for all saints. And for me, that utterance may be given unto me, and for me, that, that utterance may be given unto me, that I may open my mouth boldly to make known the mystery of the gospel, for which I am an ambassador in bonds, that therein I may speak boldly as I ought to speak. The armor of God is something that we definitely need on every single day. Like it or not, we are on a battlefield. And we are not in a battle just with flesh and blood people. We're in a battle with forces of evil. It's light against darkness. Light has already won, but we don't want to give uh, darkness unnecessary battles uh, to win in our everyday lives, even if we're gonna, we know that we're on our way to heaven. It's time to spend, spend as much time throughout the day talking to God. Talk to him like he's right there. He is right there. Be in tune with his presence throughout the day. Put on the armor early in the morning. Ask the Lord to wake you up. You don't need to be religious and set an alarm clock and say, I'm going to spend an hour with God. That's, that's too dutiful in a religious sort of external way. Ask God to wake you up in the morning to spend time with him. Ask him the night before and he will wake you up and you won't be able to go back to sleep. Just have everything ready, get your Bible, and uh, don't try to read two or three chapters of Scripture unless you feel led to do that. Just a little bit to speak to us right where we are. And, 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 and throughout the day, talk to Him. The strongholds that are in family members uh, that are in us and in all the situations that we find ourselves in can be broken through the power of prayer. And it's, it's, it's seeking his face, not just his hand. If we seek his presence throughout the day, the devil has no power. And all of the chains that he puts on us and other people are already broken. Gracious Father, we thank you for this day in Jesus' name. Amen. On the fourth day of Kwanzaa, we celebrate the fourth principle of the Nguza Saba, which is Ujama, cooperative economics. This principle encourages us as Africans in diaspora to build and maintain our own stores, shops, and other businesses, and to profit from them together. The African concept, as well as the biblical concept of cooperative economics, emphasizes the sharing of wealth and resources, whereas no one is left at the bottom of the economic ladder. Instead, all of God's children would have access to sufficient housing, affordable health care, food, and clothing, because our communal resources would be distributed equitably. The principle of Ujama encourages us to stand together, work together, and to reap together the rewards of our collective efforts. For this is the will of God in Christ Jesus 
for both you and for me. Hi there. I just got through uh, doing a memorial for John Einwick. Actually, he was supposed to be doing this because we have friends coming from Phoenix. And because he was isolated and all that because of this coronavirus, he didn't want to go out. But a couple days later, um, he called his brother to take him to the hospital. He waited there for 10 hours and they gave him some medication and two days later he died. I got to tell you about something that happened to me because I've had my hips replaced 11 years ago. They say after 10 years they just <laughs> don't laugh. And that particular day, I was so much in pain, I wanted my friend, my latte brother, to take me to the hospital immediately. And when he went down there, they said I had to wait six hours. No, I'm not waiting six hours because this is during the period of the corona. I think what we should do, I believe in God. God saved me and that's it and that's that, period. So I asked him to take me to, I think it was CVS, one of them little medical places. And I said, Glenn, get me some uh, Tylenol arthritis. Because you know I had arthritis and my hips was replaced. And usually when you're in that much pain, you have to have a cortisone shot or you get your hips replaced. Well, to make a long story short, he took me there. I got my pills. I took one. The next day, I had no pain. Is that God or what? Now, I'm going to stop doing this because this is real stuff. Believe it. In any event, we're having a memorial for uh, John Einwick. And here it is. Be blessed. Hi, this is Glenn Gross. And, uh, you know, we set up this session with the late John Einwick. He was going to make his uh, live streaming debut on the Connecting Culture Show. But uh, anyway, we decided to play anyway in his honor, kind of open free form jazz. And a number of my friends are participating, including Alan LeWine, my b bassist friend who moved to Phoenix recently. Say hi, Alan. Hi, Alan. <laughs> That'll work. That'll work. Okay, and then we got uh, Eddie Rodriguez is going to actually play hey some guys, congas. How you doing? Play it. Play a riff on the congas, Eddie. And, and we will talk in a little bit. Okay, I'm going to move this back and forth, but I'll leave it right there for now. Pretty good, I think. Um, and we'll, so we'll, we'll, we'll see each other in a little bit, guys. Oh, you want me to end it now? Yeah. Okay, so. Stay tuned. Oh, so stay tuned on Facebook Live. Stay tuned on Facebook Live for the actual session, which will be starting in about five to ten minutes. Thank you for uh, watching, and have a great day. Yeah. All right, we're live again. Alan, thank you so much for coming. I'm really enjoying this. Oh, I think this might be our first time playing in about six years or something. That means yeah, something like six years. We were at Monterey Court. This is um, Soprano Meets Space. Soprano Meets Space. Spain and the United States both represented. Oh yeah, I like this already.
back our regular piano player. That was Malik Al Kabir on the piano. I think that was I think that was the April in Paris, wasn't it? April, yes. Some approximation. Late, of, late April. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, you want to do? Um, this will be a good one. How about? Uh, how about? Um, how about footprints? You want to do footprints? Oh, sure. That's nice. Okay. You do a little bit key. We could do that one too. I mean that key. Yeah, I like that key. Yeah, yeah. Wing shorter key. yeah I think that's that's one I'm used to. Mm -hmm. yeah, I usually like to do that in six eight. So whatever you do there, I'll be in six eight. Put a six eight on top of it. That'll be cool. That'll be perfect. Sure. Yeah. So we're waiting for you. You can start. Thank you. 
There will never be another you. Also known as the sheep herders lament. Yeah, some people call it the sheep herders lament. <laughs> Indeed, we've heard that. That's, a, that's an Albuquerque joke, isn't it? I've known Alan and I are from Albuquerque. We first met 38 years ago. Something like that. And uh, his company is called Owl Song Productions. That's because you're into wise songs, right? Well, no, it's, just, it's, it's just Alan. The song. Oh, Alan's song. Alan. Owl. Okay. O -W -L -S -O -N -G. Oh, it works perfectly. I didn't, why didn't I think of that? Yeah. So we did a concert at the Chemo Theater. Do you remember what year that was? That was, was, it that was 1985. In 1985, Alan and I gave a concert. It was all Alan's original music, right, Alan? Became my first album. Yeah, his first, his very first album, and I got to play lead trumpet on it. And I think we had Peter Barbo. Yep. And who else with other sax players? We had uh, Phil Arnold on Phil, Ar Phil Arnold on trombone. That guy is I wonderful. I think Bill, uh, Bill Woods was the other sax Yeah, that's who it was. Bill Woods, right? Cal Haynes on drums. Yeah, Cal Haynes, Haynes was the drummer. It was an all-star group. Oh, yeah. And so he put out that album, and I'm still proud of it to this day. And it's been only, it's only been 35 years? Uh, 30, almost 30, 35 years. It's about almost 35 years ago. So it's so nice to have a, a reunion after 35 years, you know, with our new group of all-stars. And, and it's available online on owlsong.bandcamp.com. Okay, yeah, you just go to owlsong.bandcamp.com and you can pick up the, the collaboration that Alan and I did at Albuquerque's Chemo Theater, right? Yeah, fine room, good acoustics. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Uh, let's play something by Mingus, won't you? Uh, which one? How about Goodbye Pork by Hand? Sure. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about it. We've got a loose stand down here. Loose, loose video stand. What tune is that? Better get it in your soul. Yeah, I should know that one. I, I don't. I've heard that one before, but I don't know it. Yeah. Charlie Mills and all the good guys. <laughs> I called it by Pork by Head and I don't remember the melody. That's funny. But if you play it. Yeah, yeah, I remember now. What key is it? E flat. E flat? E flat. I'll be E flat minor. Thank you. 
You know what's embarrassing to me about that is I played um, Goodbye Pork Pie Hat at the Mingus Festival before with a, with a big band. But the thing is, then I, we had charts. I'm so used to having charts that, you know. Yeah, oh, this is a, this is I don't I have a chart. Quite a while. That one I don't remember. Yeah, it's been years. It's, all right. um, it's not surprising to me. Yeah, we've been decomposing too how about, much. How about if we do, um, how about if we do uh, Little Sunflower? I'm thinking of tunes that Garrett knows. Um, Little okay. Sunflower, even though I played it forever, I knew so. I forgot it. Oh, well, yeah, you can look that one up there. I can look it up. Yeah. Uh, the, the, uh, I love Little Sunflower. We, we played for hours and hours. This is by Freddie Hubbard, as I'm sure you know. Little Sunflower by Freddie Hubbard. In D um, I think it, what key is it usually in? It's in D. D. Yeah, You're D. You're playing a little play juice here, aren't you? Yes, I was. Yeah, he always quotes different stuff. He wasn't playing the tune we were about to play. He, he messed me up, man. Yeah. <laughs> that is funny. Yeah, I like that. We, we can certainly play that next. <laughs> uh, uh, so, um, yeah, like he said, it's in D. So why don't you start it, Gary? It's going to be E flat and D, 4444. Yeah, you'll have to hear it when he plays it. Stay here for a while. Thank you. 
Thank you. 
Oh, just one minute. Okay, then we'll stay. We'll, this muscle. we'll stay live in, in a minute for a minute. Then. How about a blues minute? So, do you know Sam's sack? Uh, um, no. Blues in there. I'll play the yeah. air. <laughs> so, if I took the call, we'd have to go yeah. off the air. Exactly. But that's like somebody made a mistake in Apple's programming. I know. <laughs> it's like this phone, same thing. Yeah. Go to another function. Cuts yeah, off. Yeah, yeah, no weird. And you should learn this very cool blues. Oh, I'll listen. Maybe I've heard Sam before. Jones. Would you Played by uh, Mel Jackson. Oh, you see my trumpet? Is my trumpet over there? Yeah, you'll recognize it. Uh, it might not be over there. Yeah, you, you know, don't see anything. Okay, it must be in the other part Mel of the Mel Jackson did on one of his non-modern jazz quartet albums. Okay, I'll play for you. This must just another blues net. Well, we could follow you. <laughs> you. You start the head, and then uh, if I'll, I'll either throw in another head or I'll try to learn it. Yeah. Ready for a blues and F? Alan's going to count this off. Two. Uh, one, two.
call that? That was all the blues. We should call that the blues to end all blues, right? All the blues. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love yeah. all the blues. Yeah, that's right. You guys, make sure you get the article right. That's what it's about, you know. Exactly right. Got to get the articles right. Isn't that true? Want to do all blues? Oh, okay. My fault. No, it sounds great too. I always like it.
Flashbacks. I don't know if you remember. We used to go to Sophie Polakowski's house. I do remember with Fred Burton on piano. Now she's Sophia sessions. Peron. Now she's Sophia yeah. Peron. Yeah. Yeah. If you're watching, uh, Sophia, we're remembering you. That's right, Sophia Peron. We remember her back when her maiden name was Polakowski. Back then. Yeah. Back. In, that's in the dark ages before there was electricity. <laughs> I think we should sign off now for a while, don't you think? Yes. Yeah. Well, I want to thank off. you guys for watching. This has been um, a jam session in memory of uh, the late piano player, John yeah, Einwick. Yeah. Uh, we couldn't help remembering him because he was the one that this schedule, this session was scheduled for. And unfortunately, he couldn't make it because he's in a better place. 
we, we presume. Oh, yes. And, uh, you know, we were all going to miss John. He was a character, and he was our regular uh, uh, partner in crime, shall we say. Musical. But, but we got a lot of the band together, and we've got a wonderful substitute in Garrick Burnett. Say hi, Garrick. Hi, Garrick. Garrick's back there at the, at the Steinway. And Alan Lewine is here. And, uh, you know, this is a special treat. I hope we get to do this again. But thank you so much for watching. Right, Thanks for well, tuning in. And I uh, hope you had a wonderful yeah. holiday and uh, Happy New Year. Let's hope that 2021 brings something that 2020 didn't show us. Yes. You know, we made, it through this, we made it through the solstice, and that signifies it's time for the return of the light. That's great. And we are all ready like for that my, light to return. There you go. And I'd like to give my thanks to Mr. Malik Alkabir. Yes, yes, indeed. Yes. Malik Alkabir. And this guy right here. <laughs> whose house we're in. Oh, Mr. yes, yeah. Okay. Yeah, my, my house is turned into a TV studio room. now. Yeah, my name is Eddie Rodriguez. Eddie Rodriguez. Uh, just a, uh, just a, a reminder, again, may, he, may, he, uh, may God rest his soul, Mr. John Einwood. Yes. So this was, he should have been here, but uh, he said he was leaving to a better place, so that's the way it is. We can honestly Good say that uh, uh, he was in all of our hearts yeah. uh, as we planned this. And we'll probably have many more jams in his honor. I think Tony Frank wants to have a, a, a in-person jam in, in Einwick's honor because Tony Frank also had John Einwick as his regular piano player for a period of years. He was with us for three years at Cafe Passe on Wednesdays and then another two years or year and a half on Thursdays. So it was like a five-year period every Wednesday, every Back Thursday. Pueblo Grill. Yeah, and when Old Pueblo Grill, he was in the house band, when Pete decided that he couldn't change his hairstyle so he was going to change his venue. <laughs> that was the, that's what he said in the email and so and um so we uh we're gonna miss john but we're thankful that we can still play music and we can still remember his musical contributions to all of our um experience so with that we're gonna say goodbye right now uh thank you for watching thank you for listening and please watch this space for more music in the future have a great day thank you guys